Hi there traders, this is Steve Miley, the market chart is for FX Explained and here we're looking at the pound versus the US dollar, the cable spot FX rate um, and looking at this from a, a day trade and of course a short term and intermediate term perspective. Well this whole sell off, this plunge lower that we saw in early September, now that was driven um, primarily in here by, um, well initially actually by a risk off theme that saw the dollar rally but then a, a, regarding um, internal concerns within the UK which I'll talk about shortly. Then we had this rebound in here last week and we pointed out that whilst below this 130.35 to 130.56 resistance area, we're looking for bearish pressures to resume. In our report, um, you can see the link to in here uh, from last week. And the market has failed at 130.07 and plunged back lower in here. And again, this week lower um, and uh, yesterday and Monday um, and down through 127.62, down through to 127.10 in here, resuming the bigger picture bearish threat. Now, this is being driven by a number of factors in here. One dollar strength. OK, so the dollar is stronger. We're in this risk on um, excuse me, risk off phase in here at the moment. Go and take a look at the S&P 500 in here. Look at this plunge lower in here again um, last week and the beginning of this week in here, taking out the previous lows from September. So a deeper correction for equities. We did get a rebound yesterday, but a deeper correction for equ equities, highlighting bearish pressures in here um, and a more of a risk off phase. And that risk off phase benefiting the dollar. So I mean, here, go sorry, back to the pound in here. Um, we're seeing um, cable lower in here, pound dollar lower because of uh, US dollar strength to an extent. But we've also got a lot of negatives in here from the pound. So we've got the internal markets bill causing um, friction in here within the UK, within the Tory party, the Conservative Party, we have, and also on an international front as well, um, and breaking potentially breaking international law. We also have the negotiations with the, between the UK and the EU still very fragile in here. And plus, we've got rising um, um, COVID cases in the UK, um, new lockdown measures, new measures enforced in here over the past 24 hours. So all of that weighing on the pound, so the pound looking more negative. And also to mention as well, Bank of England still murmuring about negative interest rates. So again. And that's negative for the pound. And it's all of that pushing pound lower, but also dollar strengthening because of that broader risk off theme. So um, negative pressures in here. And we see on the technicals in here, obviously a new low, lower lows, lower highs. And we do see real risk down to supports down here at 125 and below going into the second half of this week, maybe into if through late September and into early October. We could even be down here, down towards 123, 122. So negative pressures very much intact in here for cable um, going into today late September and early October. I'm going to wish you all a great trading day and please do stay safe out there. Join me again soon.